Welcome to your inspirational astrology horoscope for Monday, February 9th, 2015. I'm astrologer David Palmer, the Leo King, here to illuminate the collective consciousness. All my new sun sign horoscopes are up now on my apps or at leoking.lookstack.com and you can download my February 2015 horoscope at inclusiveastrology.com. But before we take a look at all the planets, let's take a look at the Leo King Planet Energy Meter to understand where all the energy is for your Monday. And I am sending my best energy for this week. Woo! I'm sending it always to you, but I just want to let you know I hope you have a wonderful week and I'm sending you all the best. And believe it or not, guess where I'm putting the energy meter today? I am putting it at the light position. Oh my gosh, when was the last time you heard me do light? I think the energy is really fluffy and easy today. The moon gonna finish off in Libra today, but it's gonna come into a void moon late tonight. And to be honest with you, it's coming off of a lot of pressure. And I think that with the sun in Aquarius and the moon and sun making a trine, this is a great day to, I think, contemplate a lot, weigh a lot out. I think that there's a lot of processing from over the weekend. And this is definitely a positive day. We've got Venus, which has come off Chiron. We got it now starting to get close to Mars. And so there's a lot going deeper inside and learning to let go, learning to just experience life. I don't think that this is a busy moment and on a Monday you might not want to do crap. <laughs> this is also the last day of Mercury pretty much at a retrograde motion as tomorrow it starts to go stationary direct. So the energy is shifting and uh, it's a kind of a pause day. A lot to ponder, a lot to question, a lot to relax in, a lot to find beauty in. This could be a great day of hanging out with people, having some interesting dialect, you know, really processing more of the fantasies in your life, daydreaming, this is a daydreaming day. This is a day where you can get kind of lost, you know. Um, it's funny, whenever I talk about like Pisces, Libra relationships, you know, uh, they become kind of this energy. Sometimes it's like, un it really just kind of like goes however it goes. The day kind of floats by. It's not a very dynamic, strength, intense, overwhelming day. I think that there's a lot to ponder though because we are getting ready. And remember, Mercury has been retrograde in Aquarius. So let's talk about this. Like we have had to experience weird aspects of ourselves. Look where Mercury has been retrograding in what house in your natal chart? Like I've had it in my sixth house. I've had the weirdest health things go on for the last week. I've had hives. I've had a weird ear problem. I had a cold that wasn't a cold. Like it's just weird. Like I'm like, what did I have? You know, but that's Mercury when it comes retrograde in Aquarius. It makes us look at weird things. And I think that we've seen life in a weird perspective over the last three weeks and there's a lot of like processing that, you know, weighing things out, kind of getting big epiphanies today and I think overall you're going to notice that it's an overall lovely day. We do have four planets in Pisces teaching surrender, teaching compassion, teaching, teaching us to kind of search deeper on our spiritual journeys right now and I think that today you'll notice with the light energy you get a little bit of a break and I'll be honest, this is one of the easiest weeks I've ever seen in the astrology. Download my February 2015 um, horoscope if you want to find out why. Check out my website theleoking.com or leoking.lookstack.com to get access to my sun sign horoscopes, my daily tarot relationship readings and my push notifications all on the app. You can get it at the app stores at Apple or Android. Thanks so much for all of your support and I will see you tomorrow.